President-elect says that he wants the people and not so-called A-list celebrities at his inauguration, which is just a few weeks away. One America's Sonny Unato explains why Donald Trump does not want the ceremony to be a star-studded event. On the campaign trail, Donald Trump said he did not need celebrities at his rallies to attract thousands of supporters. And by the way, I didn't have to bring J-Lo or Jay-Z, the only way she gets anybody. I'm here all by myself. And now the incoming president says he doesn't need the big names at his inauguration. In a tweet Thursday, the president-elect stated, the so-called A-list celebrities are all wanting tickets to the inauguration, but look at what they did for Hillary. Nothing. I want the people. In contrast to Trump's campaign, some of Hillary Clinton's rallies included performances by Jay-Z and Beyonce, as well as Katy Perry. On the other hand, Trump's run was not filled with star-studded events, but some celebrities who did support him were largely past their prime. Trump said he did not need star power to draw a crowd, but instead people showed up to his rallies merely because they supported his campaign. We do it the old-fashioned way. We do it the old-fashioned way, folks. We fill them up because you love what we're saying and you want to make America great again. That's about it. Trump's transition team says his inaugural events will include performances by the Radio City Rockettes, the Mormon Tabernacle Choir, and America's Got Talent runner-up Jackie Ivanko, who will sing the national anthem, and others have been invited. Sonny Unatoa, One American News.